everyone welcome back to my channel I am Rachel I am doing some more unboxings today I had gotten about a couple days ago the Target boxes unfortunately these boxes are not in um, available but Target comes out every month with these monthly boxes usually cost about seven dollars you have to be notified about them and buy them relatively quickly within like one or two days of when they pop up and then they ship them to you um, and it's not a, like a reoccurring monthly thing where you're automatically on the list you have to be aware of it every month so the two best places to figure out where to buy these are either go to my subscription addiction which I have talked about that website like crazy I have no affiliation but it will get you down the rabbit hole of subscription boxes or to go on actual Target's uh, website, which I'll link down below, and you can uh, sign up and they will email you or when they come available. So this month there were two boxes. There was a rejuvenation box and then the typical summer box. And one I thought was a little better than others. Um, I did have a chance to kind of go through these products a little bit, uh, do a little research on them, and actually do a price breakdown, which I've never done um, or had the time to do it. And so it's very interesting because there's how I feel about these boxes boxes and then actually what the breakdown is. So I'm going to start with the um, the box that was I was a little less excited about. It's still a good box. It is the summer box. So when you open it up it just has the orange paper and it says hello summer beauty. And so if you've never gotten these before they always come with a three dollar off coupon for the month for anything from Target Beauty and I am I, Target takes like a massive amount of my money every month so these things are very helpful and then they have a little breakdown of the products um, so I like I said did some research on these and I'm gonna go through the price and everything so this is the box I was slightly less excited about but I still think it's an awesome box so uh, one of the first things I saw on the website were these scrunchy brand elastic no damage thick hair now I have a ton of scrunchy brand um, hair ties I actually have one in my hair. You probably can't see it right there. Um, but I tend to not buy the the one for the thicker hair. I just buy the regular one. So you can see this is like the normal size one. So I'm interested because I do have really long hair if these work better or not. Um, but they gave you four of these. I love this brand. I use these things like crazy. I buy them in bulk. So anytime you throw in a little scrunchy brand hair tie, I'm going to use it. And they don't have metal on them like some do. Um, the only thing I do say with this brand is if you use them a much they do stretch out and you have to throw them away But they're they're pretty inexpensive. So the brand this cost uh, For full size was 24 pieces is 349. So this is equivalent to 58 cents So I, I am very happy about this um, The next item is one that they put in I feel like almost every single one of their boxes But I really like this brand we use it for our daughter's hair a lot. This is the Shea Moisture uh, daily hydrating leave-in treatment as you can see here so it's a leave-in conditioner and it's for all hair types and so the thing about uh, Shea Moisture is they are a very conscientious brand so they apparently use uh, fair trade ingredients when I was looking that up that means ingredients that are sourced fairly and are renewable and they're just very environmentally conscious conscious if that is something that is very important to you they're also cruelty free and um, they have some other logos that I've actually not seen that probably imply very good things. Um, so this is with coconut oil, which is uh, vitamin E, so it's supposed to nourish your hair. Coconut milk, which is supposed to smooth and soften your hair. And Akai, Acacia Senegal, which is supposed to lock in the moisture. Um, so a full size one of these is eight ounces and it's $9.99 and so this is a three ounce bottle or 3.3 fluid ounce bottle so this is about a four dollars and twelve cents so this is not a bad bad thing this is basically um a decent one now I will tell you I'm gonna spray it here it kind of has like a little bit of milky the scent is what's weird about this it almost smells like crayons I was trying to figure out like when I was using it the other day on my daughter's hair if it was like a faint coconut and I think that's what it's supposed to smell like but it smells like crayons <laughs> like melted crayons like Crayola crayons um, that being said it did soften and moisturize my daughter's quite unmanageable hair so I don't think it's a bad product um, it is just the the scent is a little weird on it so that is that product 
The next is kind of a duo that I'm gonna go over together. These are the Palmer's Coconut Oil Formula. This is a, both a shampoo and conditioner. These are 1.7 fluid ounces, which is a great travel size. Like this is perfect, it's not too big, it's not too small. Um, they again have all these little things on the back that tell you, you probably can't read real well here, but they tell you what's in them. So for example, the shampoo has coconut oil, which is supposed to shine and moisturize, Minoy oil, which is hydrates and pampers and keratin proteins to strengthen and repair. And this has everything in there except for it has, instead of keratin protein, it has argon oil, which is supposed to be brilliance and glossy. So argon oil is like a big thing in hair products right now to really make your hair shine. And then sea kelp, which is supposed to promote healthy growth. So this is the repair conditioner. Um, the breakdown on these two products are the shampoo is a little bit cheaper. It's 13.5 ounces is $4.59. So this is 58 cents. And then this one, which is the conditioner is 8.5 ounces for $4.59. So this is 91 cents. So together these are just shy of like, uh, these are about a buck 50 for this combo. All right, next item is one that I kind of had to do a little research on because I just didn't know what to think about this. This is the Aunt Jackie's Curls and Coils Don't Shrink. So this is for people with wavy curls and waves. Um, I, from what I was reading, this is much more useful for folks that have naturally very curly hair. Um, I have very mildly wavy hair and today you can't, it's pretty weighed down. I need to wash my hair. So my, my waves are pretty much gone, but um, my daughter has natural curls in her hair. So I was going to test this out on her. This is a 1.75 ounce um, sample. Honestly, it's a huge sample in a foil packet. So I feel like you'd either want to reseal this or put this in a plastic. Unless you have a lot of hair, this is probably going to get a couple of samples worth. So what I was reading on this is apparently you're supposed to put it in and, um, you know, wrap it up in your hair and then it helps like keep the curls from like frizzing and going crazy. And it, the reviews were actually pretty good about it. Um, I'm just seeing here if I put any more reviews on here. I think that was the big thing with it. Um, so full size of this is 15 ounces, it comes in like a tub and it's $7.69. So this is a 90 cent, 90 cent um, value packet, which is interesting because, you know, this is more than the shampoo, but by feeling <laughs> the shampoo seems more luxurious. So this is an interesting, interesting thing about um, prices when I started looking it up. All right, we've got two more products in here each. What I forgot to mention is each one of these boxes has about seven products. So this is the Cantu Shea Butter Leave-In Conditioning Repair Cream. This had very mixed reviews. This is a two ounce sample. And what this is supposed to do is you're supposed to put it in um, after you shower your hair and not wash it out, but while it's still wet and let it in and it's supposed to really moisturize and smooth. Again, really great for people with like natural or curly hair or very coarse kinky hair. Um, I heard it tends to make hair like mine a little more greasy. So I'm going to try it out on my daughter's hair and some people recommend even washing it out if it's a little too much, which I do that with some other hair leave-in moisturizers and they tend to work well that way. What I did read about this that some people complained about is after repeated uses, it does sometimes, some people worked great and made their hair very, very, very smooth and soft. And some people said after a while it started making my hair feel very crunchy. And apparently there are alcohols in here that can cause that. So this is just something to be aware of. I figured I'd try it out on my daughter's hair once or twice and see what it does because her hair is fried from all the swimming. So I figure I can't, can't do much more with it. Um, so the price of this is a full size is really cheap. It's 16 ounces is $5.99. So this um, sample is $1.97. So this is a decent sample. And then our last sample, which I actually was the most excited about, which probably is the, <laughs> the silliest, is the Secret Clinical Strength sample. So this is only half an ounce. This is their soft, solid um, deodorant. I have not used this particular clinical strength one. I've actually used it already. So you can see you click it up. It has this soft solid here and it's a cream basically. It goes on really well. And this stuff smells really, really good. So I use another version of their solid, which is shower fresh. And this smells kind of like the shower fresh, like a clean soapy scent, but a little bit lighter. Like, I don't know, this is a really nice scent. And I really like this. I used this the other day and it did not cause any um, 
rubbing off on my shirt, which I have had some issues in the past with the soft solids doing that. So that is really awesome. Um, I actually really, really like this and I will probably next time purchase this type of secret brand instead of my normal solid one. So this um, full size is $7.99 for 1.6 ounces and uh, this sample was $2.49. So that is that box. The total value for all seven items in this box is $11.55. You paid $7, but you get a $3 off coupon. So if you take that off, that's a pretty good value. Um, when I first opened this, I felt like, oh, this is gonna be a much higher value for what you get. And then I did the calculations and I was like, oh, it's a little less than I was thinking, but I'm still very happy. For $7, I think you get your money's worth. All right, this is the beauty box that they sent, the second one that was available for this month that I actually really loved. And this one I think was definitely worth the value. So this is their rejuvenation box. Um, again, $3 off coupon. They go over the list of things on the back here. Um, but this box was jam packed with some crazy stuff. And um, interesting again, when I first opened it, my initial impression was very different than my impression once I went through the price break it down. Um, so the first thing on top is the Trace May Repair and Protect 7 Instant Recovery Mask. This got very good reviews. Unfortunately, I don't think that this is paraben free and all the other stuff that people look for. I think this is just your typical drugstore hair mask. Um, and so some people may hate this. Some people don't care. I once in a while don't care. I wouldn't repeatedly use it because it gives build up in my hair. But for example, it's not so bad. So... This was um, a full size is 9.17 ounces and that's 4.99. This is a 1.5 ounce. I think this probably could do two times again like that other sample I showed you. So this is an 82 cents sample. All right, next thing is a full size sample of the Clean and Clear Night Relaxing Jelly Eye Sheet Mask. This had very good reviews. It is, as you can see, just to go around the eyes. One of these costs $2.59, so this is a $2.59 sample. I always love a sheet mask. I think they're a great thing to get in boxes. The next thing is their own house brand, Up and Up Whitening Strips. Now, I don't know if I can use these on my veneers. I'm going to have to do some research because I remember being told that you really don't use whitening strips. And if that's the case, I'll pass this on to someone in my family. But this has three strips um, and a normal box is 10 strips, which is $19.25. So this is a 578 sample. Now this is a Target brand sample, but still that's a pretty decent sized sample. Um, so yeah, anyway, that's that. All right, moving on next thing in here which i was super excited about so in one of my previous target boxes there was a uh, ogx coconut dry shampoo and i have used it all up i loved it and i you know was in need of another dry shampoo because i'm getting low and this one was set and this is the hask Manoy coconut dry shampoo um this one does not smell i'm gonna spray it here as Coconutty is the other one. It's a little lighter and it is extremely dry. So I'm curious how this is going to work. The other one felt it had a, some oils in it. So some people may not have liked it, but this one I think is going to work quite well. This one at full price is 6.5 ounces at $5.79 and this is 1.7 ounces. So a, a can about this lasts me about a month and a half, maybe two months. Um, and this is 151. So this is a nice sample. All right, we got three more things and then I'll be done. I'm trying to keep this video on the shorter end here. So there's a lot of products to go through, but this is another Shea Moisturizer. So again, like I said, I feel like every box they have this brand, but I love this brand. Um, this is the African Black Soap Bamboo Charcoal Body Scrub with Tea Tree Oil. And again, on the back, they tell about all their products. So the African Black Soap is supposed to cleanse and hydrate. Bamboo Charcoal is supposed to absorb and purify. And the Tea Tree Oil is supposed to soothe the skin. Now. This product retails for six ounces for $10.99, and this is two ounces. So this sample is worth $3.66. This is very interesting. Um, it doesn't have much of a smell. Like, I would expect it to have more smell. It almost has, like, no smell. And I'm going to just put a little bit of this on my hand here. So you can see it's like a gray, goopy material. Um, yeah, it just doesn't have much of a smell, but it goes on. It has like these little charcoaly beads and everything. So that's very interesting. 
I'm going to use this and try to see how it makes my skin feel. I hadn't had a chance to try this particular product out. All right, this is pretty cool. Initially, I saw this and I was like, oh, a full size item. Wow, the value of this box must be off the chart. And then I did a little research and I realized, yes, full size product, but it doesn't cost that much. So this is the Nivea Foaming Silk Mousse Body Wash Cream Moisture. They have a couple of different styles of these. This is new, but this came out in 2017. So this is not a brand spanking new bottle. Like this particular product's been out for almost a year. Um, this is 6.8 ounces. Full price, the, this is supposed to be 360, hold on. It's supposed to be 399, but it's on sale at clearance for 279. What people said is that this smells and acts like a shaving gel. Now, if you've never used a foaming body wash, they do feel like shaving gels. I love them. They feel very luxurious and soft and creamy. They don't lather up a ton, but that does not bother me. Um, they do have this little snip thing and it just doesn't have much of a smell. So I hadn't tested this out, but I was going to put a little bit of product on my hand here just to see. Okay, so I can see what they mean. It does, it does have like a more masculine scent to it um, and soapy scent. So this is what they look like. So when you use this stuff, it, it really does have the consistency of a shower gel. And that is uh, or a... Uh, a soap sorry a shaving gel so that's not abnormal but yeah it does have a um, a more scent like that so that is not I'm not actually particularly shocked by that but yeah this is cool because it's full size but this is not worth a lot of money but I'm still extremely excited about it all right final product is the cure brand and I've heard great things about this brand um, this is the brilliant brightening facial scrub now I have the facial lotion and the same line that I just bought that I was going to try out. Um, now this is very interesting. I was not expecting this when I opened this up. So I'm going to put a little bit on my hand here. It smells very planty and it kind of has a greenish brownish hue. And um, then it has, that's the dry sea kelp, makes the little beads here. So it has like this like oily slash beady smell. Or, uh, look but it is very interesting when I put it on the other day and wash it off it did leave me very moisturized and um, it was a nice product so I, I definitely think this is a very interesting product to use now this is one fluid ounce um, and these products are all the different things that you want so it's uh, I've got really good uh, stuff in it so fruit extracts it's got dried sea kelp it's got um, I can't even go over all the things, but when I was looking up this brand, it is, you know, all the stuff that you kind of want in a brand. Let me see. I have my little notes here real quick to tell you guys. So sulfate free, paraben free. Um, it, oh yeah. So it's sea kelp, which is and dehydrated lemon peel that gently exfoliates. And then it's supposed to have Madonna leaf to brighten and French green clay to pull out impurities. So this is a very intriguing Thing. So you're supposed to use this three times per week per them. So the full size price of this is four ounces for $9.99 and this is $2.50. So the full breakdown on this box is $19.65, which for a $7 box with a $3 coupon is amazing. So, you know, my first thoughts and feelings when I opened this box was this is an amazing box. Oh my God, the value is off the chart. The value is still phenomenal. After seeing the prices online, I was a little less like, oh my God, it's phenomenal. But I still love these boxes. I think there are so many cool, like everyday things that you can find that don't break the bank. So if you find something you love, it doesn't cost a fortune to buy it later, which I think is awesome. And I suspect many of you are like me. You're like, Target, take my money. Um, but anyway, that's my review of that. Um, I will put the link down below for uh, Target and uh, how to get these beauty boxes. As always, please subscribe. I am getting up there. We are so close to my 50 subscriber giveaway. I have a box of stuff ready to go to give away. Um, 
as always, subscribe, click the little warning bell down below to know when my videos come up, tell me what you think, and give me feedback on these videos. I'm always looking to improve the videos. So anyway, thank you all for watching.